to anymore. If we want to save our planet, first, we must learn how. Introducing Tribuca. Not a perfect metaverse, but a flawed one, just like our planet. However, it can be saved by learning sustainability. Join us as we play, learn, and regenerate the Tribuca metaverse and our own Earth with our unprecedented Regenerate to Earn system. Because there's no other planet, and there's no escape from reality. Tribuca, coming soon. Okay, everyone. Thank you. Uh, good afternoon. Uh, I would like to welcome all of you. And today, uh, first of all, actually, I would like to thank the organization team at first, uh, Raushan Bey and, uh, of course, Alexi, for inviting uh, us and for giving us a chance uh, to present our project. So, today, can you see this? Have you seen? Today I, uh, I am going to uh, tell you about our Play to Earn Metaverse project. Uh, in the... Okay. Have you seen that? Okay, I'm going to tell you about our interesting uh, Play to Earn Metaverse game project uh, in the agricultural domain, uh, carrying off uh, Web3 features. So, uh, first of all, uh, I would like to start the why we dive into this kind of uh, project with my friends. Uh, well, uh, we, uh, we are a few nature lovers, just like you. So we care about uh, nature drastic issues uh, like uh, soil erosion, carbon emissions, uh, or global warming. So we, we wanted to raise awareness uh, in the improper agricultural practices uh, which we think are causing these issues uh, by affecting each other like dominoes. So uh, we thought that if we, if we could provide uh, a metaverse game uh, with Web3 features, uh, everything might be much different in terms of, uh, you know, uh, uh, making some helping food security or or uh, making some contribution to reduce carbon emissions or even global warming so as you know maybe you uh, you know there are lots of misconceptions and and misunderstood facts in the conventional farming uh, such as uh, such as you know uh, tillage the tillage the soil uh, which is uh, the, uh, some causing to soil erosion or irrigating uh, crop with underground uh, water uh, which should be stay underground also even uh, you know some uh, using chemicals uh, which is too dangerous for us uh, so uh, we uh, we decide uh, we decide to try to simulate uh, metaverse uh, project uh, in the agricultural domain to give you an experience uh, uh, in the good agricultural practices that uh, can be useful uh, in the real world so in this way why you learn in the game uh, you will uh, earn money also you will have a chance to apply these experiences that you learn from the game in the real life uh, agricultural domain. So I would like to tell you about our, uh, I think it doesn't see in this slide, uh, I'm sorry for that. Uh, tell me about our uh, key components of the Tribuca Metaverse game. So Tribuca first will be a decentralized blockchain based metaverse game. Uh, carrying of Web3 uh, feature, uh, like I said. And also, since we commit that Tribuca 
uh, will ensure open standards and protocols and also interoperability. Uh, Tribucom Metaverse will be an open metaverse uh, in the play to earn gaming concept. Uh, as per our concept, we call it regenerate to earn uh, gaming concept. So our gaming concept uh, will be in the agricultural domain, like I said, and uh, for uh, for the purpose of uh, for for the purpose of uh, you know uh, some misconceptions. Also, in Tribuka Metaverse, you will have interactive and intelligence uh, NFTs. Uh, that is INFTs, uh, unlike the other Metaverse game and. And blockchain games. So our uh, our base blockchain uh, will be RSK blockchain, uh, which is the uh, most suitable platform uh, for us for implementing our innovative uh, uh, innovative architecture. So uh, also we are going to use RSK infrastructure framework, uh, which has visionary Web3 feature to bring Tribuka closer to Web3 architecture. And lastly, uh, we uh, Tribuka game engine will be based, uh, equipped by evolutionary competing technologies or uh, also related simulation technologies like artificial intelligence, uh, agent-based modeling, uh, system dynamics, ontology engineering, uh, to commerce the real life uh, in the agricultural domain. So I would like to give you some uh, information about our game concept. So in Tribuka Metaverse, uh, to play and earn money, uh, of course you will you will be able to have an avatar, and uh, you will uh, you can buy. Uh, you can buy a number of or a bunch of INFTs which are the soil or landscapes, uh, seeds, plants, microorganisms, mushrooms uh, and domestic or undomestic animals. Uh, so since the uh, INFTs you will have uh, will be alike. Uh, during the game, you need to, uh, you need to uh, apply some practices uh, to keep them healthy and alive. So, in addition to, in addition to uh, selling, buying, or trading INFTs that I told you uh, in the game, uh, the INFTs uh, would interact with each other independently of you. Uh, within a certain settings uh, by focusing their activities uh, while achieving uh, given practices they can get ill or be unhealthy uh, and then uh, can be uh, exposed to some disasters or even die uh, when the right time comes. So Tribuka, as I told you, will be kind of uh, real life simulation in agricultural domain and uh, and so so uh, the game will have uh, a, will have a, a big bang and will have a continuity in a timeline and also the game uh, constantly evolves each time uh, itself uh, uh, for using uh, for for the place. Okay, now uh, I'm going to tell about our tell about our game evolution. Uh, saying game evolution, actually, uh, we are not going to design every stage of the game. Uh, actually, I mean uh, there will be no uh, uh, game levels or stages. Uh, which will be uh, which will pass to uh, uh, by completing number of tests. Unlike the game, uh, unlike players uh, regenerate to try become metaverse uh, 
uh, by their uh, ever-changing strategies uh, against complexity uh, to emerge uh, unpredictable way. Uh, so, as I told you, the, the game will have a big bang and will have a continuity in a timeline. Uh, so you need to you need to uh, constantly develop a strategy, uh, some events uh, that may, may, may be, uh, be some uh, hazards, some uh, dangerous in the INFTs. Okay. Uh, the now, I would like to give you about our technological stake. And maybe you don't see in the slides, uh, Tribuka uh, in our uh, layer one uh, uh, will be Bitcoin uh, blockchain platform. Uh, so let me why we, we are using uh, Bitcoin in the layer one. Uh, in the emergence of the Bitcoin uh, provides uh, a decentralized phenomena or decentralized uh, dimensions in the fields of in the fields of some uh, you know uh, game theory uh, and uh, cryptography and, or crypto economies. So we uh, since we uh, much more uh, matter the Bitcoin. Uh, Bitcoin uh, has only uh, important uh, Bitcoin, uh, blockchain platform in terms of some security and or uh, and its incentive mechanisms. And uh, actually, in short, uh, my presentation is uh, finished. Uh, so it's an ongoing project, and we are still developing our MVP uh, to be launched, uh, I think, in two months. Uh, so, uh, uh, if you uh, need any further details, you can reach our uh, website or uh, we have already white papers. Uh, you can read it for details. Also, uh, you can reach out to me. Uh, we can happily help to you inform our project with my, uh, my friends, Emir and Jane. Please raise your hand to know people uh, to reach to you. Okay, uh, if you have any question, I'm ready to answer about our interesting project. <laughs> Please. Why Bitcoin? Why Bitcoin? Bitcoin because it's a, uh, in, in, its, uh, in its time, uh, always is uh, and its incentive mechanism and security architecture uh, has strong accountability and credibility uh, in their platform. So that's why we use uh, Bitcoin because we uh, doesn't trust the other uh, the other altcoins. That's why. <laughs> okay, thank you. Thank you very much for listening to us. So listening to